hey, I didn't see you there. Well, since you're here already, let's, let me tell you a little story about the golden age of film. Now, to start things off, we'll play my favorite record. It's a jazz record. The 1920s was an era of cultural discoveries. For example, the explosion of jazz, a new music genre at the time using beats and rhythm from places like Africa. But America had its own discoveries in the field of an exciting new form of entertainment, film. Even if the film industry was booming, fame was not easy to come upon in the United States. People didn't have the luxury of internet or television, so people flocked to the one place that could either make them or break them, Hollywood. Well, there's somebody who you can cuddle up to, ain't that a grand was like a gold rush after the gold rush. Everyone wanted to be a star and take home the gold. And if you're lucky, you would be able to find stardom in being an extra. But few became A-listers like Charlie Chaplin, Al Jostin, and Sunshine Sweat, but I know where, and Rin Tin Tin. Are you kidding me? He was just a stupid dog. I know, but he's more famous than you are. Although the film production industry was relatively new, five large companies controlled most of all. Metro Goldwyn, 20th Century Fox, Paramount, RKO Productions, and Warner Brothers Productions. Directors wanted their works to be seen by many. They would have to go through one of these major studios. In 1927, when sound movies were invented, many silent film actors find themselves out of a job because they either had bad voices or couldn't remember their lines, effectively ending the silent movie era. Hollywood became the world's film capital. The weather was good, it had favorable lighting, and varied landscapes. Around 80% of films in the 20s were filmed in or around Hollywood. They're ringing out our song of love. I press you, caress you, and bless the day you taught me to care. Today, film is one of the most important parts of media and art. I wouldn't even be able to inform you about the topic if it wasn't for its influence in the 1920s. Film has gone so far since then, but more on that later. So as always, good night and good luck.